Okay, so just as uh, the latest update on uh, this animatronic head project, the head is uh, completed, obviously, except the, the skin isn't placed over it yet, but the basic structure is there. Uh, and the controller, the custom controller that I designed and built, is finished. Um, and I'll just demonstrate a few of the functions on this now. The, 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 the controller uses an XB uh, wireless interface uh, to talk to the head. Um, and so the left controller, you know, controls the pan and tilt of the head up and down. Uh, you can see the, uh, I'm using the uh, acceleration controls in the, in the Maestro servo controller. Uh, to give more realistic head motion, so it's not quite as jerky as it would be otherwise. Uh, you'll notice if I pull it, the, the the handle all the way forward and then release it, his head comes back up a little more naturally than it would if the joystick was uh, was directly controlling the servo with no acceleration control. Uh, the eyes uh, work off the other joystick, and uh, they go up and down and left and right. Uh, the mouth is actually controlled directly by analyzing the audio uh, signal coming in, and I don't have that uh, running yet. Uh, these are interesting. I use the sequencing uh, or uh, scripting capability in the Maestro servo controller, so uh, I could control, create fairly complex uh, functions with just a push of one button. And right now, I've just got a few programmed in here, but. Uh, and the first one's very simple. It's, uh, it, you probably wouldn't actually do this, but just for demonstration purposes, uh, a sing, uh, pushing the button down causes him to look left, releases it, causes the eyes to come back to the previous state. Uh, the next button, uh, you press it, causes him to say nod yes, and you notice it's just a single press, and he does the, the script does all the work. Uh, if I want him to say no. I can do the same thing with the next button, with button 3. And then uh, button 4 uh, uses a, a combination of three servos. Um, so when I press, press button 4, it goes into thinking mode. And when I release it, it returns to the previous state. So I can, uh, for example, I can ask uh, Harvey a question like, uh, Harvey, would you like me to erase all of your memory? He thinks about it for a minute and then gives me his answer. Uh, the other function that I've got built in here now is uh, what I call smart eyes or tracking eyes and if I flip this switch over here you'll notice that, uh, let, me let me flip it off first and notice how his eyes track with his head, they just point straight ahead uh, no matter what direction the head is going. Um, but if I have it in smart eyes mode then the eyes will <laughs> look at me as uh, the head moves, they keep focus straight uh, on on what he's looking at there. Uh, so there, <laughs> that's uh, gives him kind of a human-like quality. Then, as he uh, starts to kind of look around, uh, he uh, kind of keeps it, tries to keep his eyes focused on on, on whatever is in front of him. Uh, and that's pretty much it. Uh, pretty much uh, all I have in here right now, um, and I'll. Uh, do another video once I've done a little bit more.